Nasaan tayo? Dubai! Yes, sir! We're here in Dubai. We're actually staying dito sa Hyatt Place. Kita nyo naman yan yung view namin sa aming room. Maganda naman. And if there's like one word that we can use to describe Dubai so far, it is... Mainit! Di ba? Sobrang init. So anyway, I'm here for a talk. Um, I was actually invited by our good friend Randall Chongson. Meron siyang event dito, Money Talk. So kasama namin si uh, Sir Rex, si Randall. Ako will be talking about different things on how to make money, how to invest, and how to build like a better future for yourself. So in terms of what I packed, very quickly, yan yung gamit ko. Um, I, actually, I actually just brought one pair of sneakers. So ang ating sneakers of the day, uh, these are the Louis Vuitton runner sneakers that I got. Uh, from a recent trip, di ko na malala. Ay, sa Philippines ko to binili. I bought it for the Philippines when we went to San Francisco. Before we went to San Francisco. And then in terms of sandals, we have this, uh, which is one of my favorites right now, which is the Salei Bemberi, Bemberi, Bemberi na Crocs. Na sobrang komportable, sobrang ganda patingdan. So anyway, uh, wife and I are preparing. I actually shot this same shot the same footage kanina. Uh, inuulit ko lang kasi hindi pala naka on yung mic, so walang audio. So <laughs> <laughs> Nag-shoot pa man din ako ng breakfast, no, babe? Oh. Pinakita ko kanina. Oh, yan si Mrs. Nag-shoot pa man din kami ng breakfast scene. Pero mukhang wala na yun. So, we'll head down. Um, nandun na yung sundun namin. We'll head to the event. And yun, sama lang kayo for day one of Dubai. Si Ate Melin, guys. Oh. You Hello. know. Ayan. So, ito ang Dubai. Nasaan tayo, Ate? Ngayon? <laughs> ano ba itong area na ito? Pamak, uh, ano? Clock Tower. Ito yung Clock Tower ng Dubai. Ah. Sorry, parang tourist spot? O wala lang? Uh, Isang to sa ano, uh, tourist spot dito. Parang social nga siya tingnan eh, no? Uh, Lumang structure. Mm -hmm. ah, wow. Siyempre sponsored by Omega. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Meron dito. So yan guys, sa so, mga nagtataka what Dubai looks like. So far, dito pa lang tayo. Pero mamaya, bukas tsaka the next few days, ikot-ikot tayo. Uh, yung bus dito, Mercedes. <laughs> Talaga? Yeah. Grabe. Yung, yun guys, Prado na parang truck, yun daw yung ginagamit ng mga polis dito. Tapos yung mga buses daw dito Mercedes. Wawa naman yung love bus natin sa Pilipinas. <laughs> <laughs> yung color blue. Nalala mo ba ba yun? <laughs> may fountain siya. Ang cute. Ay, ang ganda. Medyo mainit lang talaga. Okay, so during the talk, we had three speakers. There was Randall, then there was me, and then there was Rex Mendoza. We also had a panel of Filipino entrepreneurs. Uh, who are based in Dubai, nakakatuwa yung stories nila, sobrang inspiring. Now, obviously, I won't, you know, show the entire talks of everyone, pero yun, gusto ko lang kwento sa inyo, the event went well, we were at the Emirates Avi Aviation Stu Stadium, or room, or hall, and nakakatuwa overall yung uh, dumating na mga tao. Now, at this point in the vlog, I'll show you guys what happened uh, after, which was our dinner, at one of the best seafood restaurants that I've been to, which is owned by a Pinoy. Apparently, they now have over 10 branches in Dubai. It's called Off the Hook. So check out this one. Randall, come here, Randall. Come here. 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 Successful. So, para to parang lalagay nila yung... Very social media friendly business. Kaya naman mga ice supply niyan. Nag-improve na siya. Kaya mm -hmm. mm -hmm. meron na stock dito. Mm -hmm. Masak! <laughs> yeah! Kasama mo kayo. Oo, kasama yun sa vlog. Yeah, Randall. Yeah! Ito ang mukha ng tagumpay, guys. Tapos... <laughs> Now, after off the hook, pumunta naman kami or hopped on the car again. And apparently, yung mga malls dito close late. Reminds me of the Philippines. Yung Dubai Mall, which is the world's biggest mall, apparently closes at 1 a.m. 
So kasama namin sila Randall Pumunta kami sa Dubai Mall To check out uh, the Nike Town Shop there Which I've heard a lot about um, And also I wanted to see the world's largest indoor aquarium Ayan, tayo ngayon sa loob ng Dubai Mall Ang wild lang guys Ooh. So, pumunta tayo Nike Town. Hinahanap natin siya. So, ito yung Nike Town. Dito sa Dubai Mall. So, let's check it out and see what's inside. So, inside the Nike Town shop in Dubai Mall, uh, wow, it was massive. It was super, super, super big. Dedicated sections for Air Maxes, for basketball shoes, for running shoes, uh, and of course, lots of apparel. Now, in terms of yung mga nakita natin, there were a lot of Jordan 5 sitting different colorways. There was a really nice looking loud colorful Jordan 4 that apparently they still had it in my size. And then they had a lot of Lebrons including the new one that's kind of like the new version of the animal print I think. Naalala ko pa yung binigay ni DJ Big Boy Cheng sa akin na animal print a couple of years back. And everything else are the other sneakers that you'd normally expect to see. Now, napadaan din kami ng Foot Locker and doon, napabili si Randel, medyo nabudol siya. Uh, may nakita kaming sobrang unique na blazer low jumbo. Uh, but instead of the typical one-colored swoosh, there was a giant white swoosh and parang may streaks of black and hints of orange. So it was truly one of the best looking blazer lows I've seen in a while. So obviously we're back here at the hotel and I just wanted to show you guys ano yung binili ko. I ended up buying the most expensive Jordan uh, in Nike Town, at least in my opinion, kasi hindi naman siya umabot normally ganito kamahal. Uh, this is the Jordan 4, I think it's called the Zen Master. It's a special edition Jordan 4, which from what, what I read, apparently commemorates the friendship between Phil Jackson, of course the coach of Michael Jordan, uh, and Michael Jordan from the Bulls. Diba? Kasi nga, if you watch The Last Dance, parang yung nickname nila for Phil Jackson was the Zen Master. And apparently this one, when it comes to the colors, the calming use, apparently yun yata ibig sabihin niya. Si Missy, santay niya dito. Ano yung isi mo dito? Sun, ano yun? Sunset. So yan, Jordan 4 Sunset. So parang makulay siya. I, I, I'll probably wear it today, which is actually day two already of our trip in Dubai. <laughs> Uh, quick note, by the way, it also comes with like purple-ish laces. So if you want to go all the way na ganyan yung chura, pwede mo rin gawin yun. Actually, it's very nice, no? One of the nicest looking uh, light-colored Jordan 4s that I've seen in a while. Now, why is this the most expensive? Kasi I think I ended up paying 1,100 uh, dirhams for it. And if you convert that to pesos, that's roughly 16,500 pesos. Whew. And if you take a look at the SRP, uh, normally this should be around 210, 220 USD. So, parang na overpriced siya ng halos 30, 40%. So, parang I paid resale for it, even though it was on retail. So, mahal pala dito. <laughs> I don't know if it's because of the, the conversion, pero sobra mahal siya. I think I could have gotten it for resale, maybe even lower in the Philippines, pero. I wanted to buy a sneaker to commemorate our Dubai trip. Kind of like when I buy sneakers when I'm outside of the country to, you know, commemorate and remember and immortalize that particular trip. So, ito, this is my official, like, Dubai shoe. Uh, let me know what you guys think of the sneaker in the comment section down below. As usual, would love to hear from all of you. Mag-hi kayo para sa vlog. Hi, mag-hi kayo para sa vlog. Hi, daw sa vlog. Hi. Just call me Ari sa mga mukha niyo. Colin, Colin, may papakita ako sa iyo, teka. Wala pa ako may ganyan, babe. Teka lang, teka lang. Oh. Oh, nice. Wild ba? Ang ganda. Wild ba? Okay mukha ko ah, may butterfly. 
Ano ba yan, babe? That's day one uh, of our Dubai trip. Maraming salamat again to Randall. And of course, sobrang panalo yung talk ni uh, Rex Mendoza. I'll probably do like a quick summary on the learnings on Facebook. Pero sobrang inspiring, sobrang nakakatuwa. Maraming salamat sa everyone who was at the talk, uh, who attended day one. Uh, thank you for listening and, and I hope you learned something from my session. And today, day two, looking forward to teaching again. Um, this time, how to you know build a business and how to accelerate your growth as a creator. So, yun yung akin topic for today. So, anyway, that's it for today's session, guys. Um, make sure to tune in again tomorrow for or in a couple of days for Dubai day two, day two sa vlog. As usual, this is Carlos signing out. Peace, God bless, what's up? Boom.